from Goldberger Memorial Field in Mount Hawken. It's short conference football on Rallycast. Tonight, number one, Toms River North, 7-0, and oh, versus number two, Southern Regional, 6-1, and one, in a battle for first place in the American Division. A battle of two of the best linebackers at the shore, Toms River North, with the number one defense in the conference. Number 34 is Zach Kane, linebacker. He's the heart and soul of the Mariners' defense. His counterpart is number 40, Glenn Carson of Southern Regional. In the first quarter, Toms River North on the march. The quarterback is Anthony Penna. He throws complete to Pedro Soto down inside the Southern Regional 15-yard line. On the first play of the second quarter, fourth and one at the two-yard line, this is number 27, Marlon Brinson, and this is a touchdown. Tom to the north, out to a seven-to-nothing lead. That Mariner defense almost impossible to crack. Here, number 36 linebacker Nick Fukarakis gets after Todd Kaiser and pulls down the Southern Regional quarterback. And the Mariners take a 7-0 lead to the locker room at the half. In the second half, TR North looking to extend its lead behind the running of Marlon Brinson. Brinson gets it down to near the goal line, and then Brinson gets it into the end zone. That touchdown capping an 81-yard drive in 12 plays, and Tom Jerry North now takes a 14-0 lead as we go to the fourth quarter. Southern trying to come back, fourth and one at its own 25-yard line. It's going to go for it. Kaiser puts it up on fourth and one, completes it to Brad Gesser. Big call, big play out to the 46-yard line. Rams continue to drive. Third and one now at the Tons of the North, 27. Kaiser going for it all, going deep, and Eric Sharkey makes the catch in the end zone. A great play, and the Mariners' lead is cut to 14-7. But Tom to the North is not going to crack. It's second down and 10 at its own 20-yard line. Anthony Penna throws, and it's complete to Pedro Soto, and Soto has lots of room to run. Soto takes it all the way down to the southern 10-yard line, a crucial play in the game. Now kick it, go. Kick it. It sets up a Pete Zukic's field goal, and that puts it away for Tom to the North. The Mariners take it 17-7. to after the game, we talked to Fukarakis about that Tom's River North defense. We're well-rounded. we got lots of players that know what they're doing. And, uh, you know, we got a lot of different people. we got a sophomore starting linebacker. He's, he's a good player. And we got Kane, middle linebacker. And we got just all-around good players. So it works out. What was your defensive game plan coming in tonight? You certainly put a lot of pressure on, on the quarterback. Yeah. You know, a lot of pressure on the quarterback. Well, the main plan was to, uh, you know, if they came out in doubles, that we'd uh, drop back. I would drop back and uh, try and get the pick. But they didn't really run that too much. So, uh, you know, we just kept pressuring the quarterback and worked out good. Chip LaBarca, Tom's River North coach, talks here about that big fourth quarter pass play that really won the game and clinched it for the Mariners. You can't be closed-minded and just run the ball there because that's what they're thinking you're, you're, you're going to do. And, and they're, they're a good team. So if you're just going to run the ball, any good team is, is going to stop you. So I think you've got to mix it up, and you know, we, we mix it up right there at the, at the right time. Again, the final score in the showdown for first place in the short conference American division, Tom's River North 17, Southern 7 on Rallycats.